Welcome to Digital Exposure TV. Today I'm going to show you a quick tip for Blender and it's a really important tip if you want to build anything that's to do with architecture or game assets or anything really. It's how to change the units of measurement um, in the software. So I've built this kind of cube thing over here just to illustrate something to you. Uh, if you look here on the right hand side this menu opens up when you press the N key and you'll see the dimensions of this particular object or whatever you object you highlight and you've got the X, Y and Z axis of the dimensions and they're in blender units at the moment so it's like 3.430 blender units but obviously you know in the real world and for application purposes you want that in the metric system um, which is the most commonly used system so if you look on the right hand side here and you look at the small tab at the top we're on the render tab at the moment and if you shift over two more tabs to the one with a little sun and a circle and a sort of building you will see this tab and under units it says unit presets and if we go over to centimeters you'll see it automatically changes to the metric system and you will see that now we've highlighted this it says it's in 3.43 centimeters um, on the x-axis and then y-axis two centimeters and then if we sort of change the size you can see the size go up so that would be 37 centimeters like the z-axis which is up and down is 66 so if we put it at one meter uh, about there that's about the height of yeah, sort of six foot man I guess um, or a six foot woman depending on how many tall women you have where you live um, and if we go into the other views you can see on the top left here it says 10 centimeters and that's represented by one cube so if we are not the large cube by the way the uh, the smaller one there so if we zoom in these small cubes here that make up this larger one each small cube it says there are in centimeters so if we zoom out each small cube is 10 centimeters we zoom out again each sorry about this each uh, cube there the large cubes oh god this really doesn't want to stay does it uh, the larger cubes like this one is 10 Oh, the smaller one's 10 centimeters if I zoom out more. There we go. Now you see the larger cubes is meters. So if I sort of drag, you know, uh, resize this up, you'll see that it's three large cubes in height almost. Let's just change that slightly, which means it should be three meters in size. So that's in centimeters there. But you get the idea. So there you go, that's how you change it to the metric system. And there's other systems as well. You can um, have it in imperial, so it's like in feet and inches. Um, you can change that to inches, there you go. Or you can switch it. So basically you've got your units here on the top and then just underneath you've got the actual system. So you've got metric system centimeters, then you've got um, imperial and you can have inches. So there you go. It will change the size of your objects, but you can e easily make them bigger and smaller. And to be fair, if you change it to the metric system before you build your objects or whatever system you want to use, then it will be fine. So thank you very much for watching, guys. If this was helpful, please give it a thumbs up. And if you think this will help other people that you know, please share this video because it really helps the channel out. And please subscribe for more videos.